The i40 Tourer is without doubt Hyundai's best attempt at cracking the family estate market yet. It looks great, it's practical and like all Hyundais it comes with a 5 year warranty. The i40 Tourer looks every bit as good as its rivals and it's on the pace in the way it drives. The handling is composed and the i40 feels stable on the motorway. It's a shame then that the steering has a rather artificial feel. The suspension treads a fine line between control and comfort too and some people will find it rather too firm. There's a choice of petrol and diesel engines. The petrol versions aren't likely to be that popular so we'll concentrate on the 1.7 litre diesels. The entry level version is impressively clean but the higher powered version is almost as efficient and a bit more flexible. Refinement is good with all noise sources well contained but a sweeter gear shift would improve things further. The i40's interior design isn't quite as striking as its exterior. It's form over function in places with a very busy centre console and materials that aren't quite a match for those in a Ford Mondeo or Volkswagen Passat. But there's plenty of space inside with head and legroom to spare. The boot is one of the biggest in its class, although it's surprisingly narrow. Low ownership costs are key to the i40's appeal and the cheapest versions undercut many rivals on price. It comes with lots of kit too including alloy wheels, air conditioning and Bluetooth. Higher up the range though the i40 doesn't represent such a good value. Running costs are reasonable if not class leading for all versions and every i40 has the benefit of a Hyundai's 5 year unlimited mileage warranty. The i40 Tora looks the part and cheaper versions are sound value for money. Overall however we would prefer a Ford Mondeo or Volkswagen Passat. They're pricier but a bit more polished.